All right, thank you, Tony. Our big game coverage continues at 5.30. Let's give you a live look at Gillette Stadium right now. And as you can see, it's quiet now, but fanfare has died down after this morning's super send-off rally. It was a much different scene this morning. Thousands of fans packed together outside Gillette Stadium to send the Pats off to Minnesota. Eyewitness News anchor Patrick Little was at Gillette Stadium this morning, bright and early at 345. But some fans got there even earlier. Patrick has more from the rally, new at 530. Not done. That's the theme for this year's playoff run for the Patriots. Last year it was do your job. This morning, the Pats fans certainly did their job. Where are you from? These folks from Peru, Maine, the first to the party at 3 in the morning, six hours before the party started. Well, this is what I wear every time I come to a game or send off something like that. You know, just got to support the team. Let them know we're rooting for them. This dad from Woonsocket thought today was perfect for some father-son's bonding time. Yeah, we called out well today. We are too well to go to school. So what, uh, what motivated you to bring the boys up here to see this? The boys have never been to a Patriots rally, so today is our first rally, and next week's our first parade. There was a huge Super Bowl cake for Patriot fans to enjoy. A lot of signs, songs. Players and Coach Belichick only on stage for about 10 minutes, but for these fans, it was well worth the wait. Woo! Let's go, Patriots Nation, baby! Yeah! Doing it again until Tom Brady retires. Every year. Very optimistic. Tell you what, a lot of optimism up here at Gillette Stadium this morning. We'll see if there's another party to plan a week from now. In Foxborough, I'm Patrick Little, Eyewitness News.